I know Larry has one glass of red wine and all That's bets are true. off. Listen, so. if I hear Grease playing when I'm walking <laughs> in that door, I'm turning right around and walking right back out. Huh, huh. Grease? Uh, like the musical Grease? Uh, They're playing a lot in the bars? Any of it. <laughs> in Lake Forest they are. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, there it is. Wow. Keeping it current again, oh. Pat. I know you like uh, what we yeah, do, Pat. I love the... Number nine, who does it? Right. Love Sloan Peterson from Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Oh, yes. Oh, Sloan, dear. I guess that's my dad. Mr. Rooney, I want to thank you for your warmth and compassion. Hi, Cameron. You comfortable? Hi, Sloan. No. <laughs> So whatever happened to the actress, Mia Sara? Yeah. Well, she acted in lots of things for a bunch of years after Ferris, but she decided to step away and concentrate on writing. She's written some well-received poetry, which you can read on her website, and she's not hiding. You can follow her on Instagram and get this. She was first married to the son of Sean Connery, and uh. now she seems uh, happily married to director Brian Henson, son of Jim Henson. Wow. She has two wow. kids and appears to have a very nice family. All the best, Sloan. Uh, what do you know? That. Huh. All right, number eight, the latest debate on TikTok is over whose responsibility it is to put the divider on the conveyor belt in the supermarket checkout. Oh, brother. Is it you or the person behind you? It's definitely you. It's you. It's definitely you. Most que without question, it's you. Some say when you're finished putting your groceries on the belt, but the barrier ups, the person behind you knows you're done. Absolutely. Others say it's up to the person behind you to yeah. separate the goods. Some believe it's just about whoever's the closest. Oh, wait. I don't care. <laughs> really? Who cares? Is there a bi is it a big problem to put it up if you don't see it there? This no, is a big but debate. If, if you don't put it up, and you you're a lesser human being, oh, brother. That's really, right, Michael? I think that's true. This is the kind of thing, though, when you post it on the internet, it blows up. Yeah, right. 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 Did you notice the 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 picture we have there? Is a is someone at the grocery checkout sitting in a chair? What you don't see that too what often. Do you mean? The, uh, the cashier? The cashier. Wouldn't that be comfortable? Mm. They're standing all day long. I yeah. keep thinking that when I go through, you know? Always yeah. the deep thinker going that Look second level. Just saying. I mean, there's, there's you're chairs. Like, uh, that you're like Costanza getting a chair for the doorman. <laughs> <laughs> and then he falls asleep. Yeah. And then, that, and then what right. happens? Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. You, can, just, you can sense just the slightest amount of human suffering. That's uh, a gift yeah. that you've had yeah. for years and years. Uh, number seven. Uh, did you know that you can make soap at home? And you can do it in all what sorts of shapes. What is going on here? Like a doll head. Oh, oh no. Or your hand or your foot. Uh, for some, you oh. can just use a rubber glove for molds. Oh. You just need to get something called an alginate gel, which is basically a dried seaweed powder that allows you to make the mold. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. This is nuts. Look uh. at that. Or you oh, can just disturbing. buy it for... Look at, boy, that's Whoa. a lot of work. Oh, but that's fun. You imagine <laughs> that rubbing is. that all yeah, over your body, that's, Robin? Yeah, that's great. That, that oh, fun? no. A nose. Yes. <sighs> and you know what? When you have a decorative, oh. There you go, a little tongue on the... <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> When you have decorative soap, though, it's guest soap. You're not supposed to technically use it. It's yeah. just for display. Decorative right? soaps are yeah, for guests? Yeah, that's, so a, that's that what my mom always told me. You just leave it, you know... For all the guests yeah. that you had at your... <laughs> Lots of guests coming yeah. over. Yeah, a lot over oh, that place. Oh, yeah. yeah. And you have the fancy towels and the fancy uh, soap. You're not uh, supposed mm. to actually use those. We used uh. to get in trouble. Number six, the hot Mother's Day trend she'll never see coming. Shriveled flowers. Dried flowers are suddenly everywhere. They're competing with fresh bouquets and showing up as gifts and stylish home decor, but these are not your grandmother's dried flowers. These sculptural bouquets mix intricate textures with bright colors, creating a gathered in a field type look. Now, I'd like that. 
because there's a lot when you get regular flowers they die You're in a couple of days. Work. It Larry, is. It's a lot of work. And then you, you gotta, gotta you throw gotta them out. Water them. You gotta empty the water. You yeah. gotta trim them. I, I don't need it. Right. Well, with these supply chain <laughs> issues, this is perfect. The dog's gotta go out. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Look at that. I get those at Pier 1? Where do I get them? Oh, I, that's a good question. Have you read the story? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Where do you get them? Potpourri is us. Pier 1 anymore? <laughs> I don't know if there's one. Oh, I think they're yeah. gone. Oh. Oh. What a shame. All right, number five. This cool looking creature is a leukistic sea turtle. It has a genetic deviation that causes its cells to develop improperly, so their skin may have patches of white or pale patches everywhere, except for their eyes. The leukistic creatures are known for having beautifully colored eyes. Wow. That looks fake, doesn't it? What do you know? It does. Ooh. Look at wow. it. That's a baby. Ugh. All right, uh, number four. Already, it may look like a bunch of bananas, but actually, it's a glove. Banana Fingers is a new type of assistive glove created by researchers at MIT. The fingers are inflatable, and when pumped up, they allow the glove to grip objects like a can of soda or a tennis ball. Hmm. Well, this is, it's meant to help people with injury limited mobility or other trauma to the fingers. Oh, that's a great, amazing what they can do. It's amazing. Isn't it amazing what they can do? That was such a mom quote right there. <laughs> that's it's very amazing true. what they can do these days. The conductive yarn is made of, uh, is a sensing fabric that allows you to actually feel hmm. what you're touching. Look at that. that. That's cool. All righty, number three, men's fashion has crossed into the leave nothing to the imagination era. Have you noticed that men seem to have more see-through shirts no, these days? I have not. Apparently it's part of a trend to free the nipple. Designers like Prada and <laughs> Valentino are making really? more shirts out of mesh and skimpy lace huh. to show off the pecs, tattoos, and chest hair. Yeah. Dara Leto wore a skimpy lace shirt at the Grammys in April, and they're getting popular in the warmer climates. Oh, yeah. Since a sheer shirt is as close as you can get to wearing no shirt oh, at yeah. all. Well, Larry, I know you used to wear that uh, that cropped mesh uh, football jersey, yeah. the old yeah. uh, Sigma Nu jersey yeah. right back yeah. in yeah. Uh, college. Yeah, you sticking Ooh. out. Yeah. <laughs> that was a big Yeah. I gotta give them the world has been asking to see more of my chest hair. Yeah. <laughs> they, they All right, number two, there's a food truck park coming to Chicago soon, but Walter Scott was way ahead of them. He had food wagons. It all started in 1872. Just a man with a dream to sell night lunch. Most restaurants closed at 8 p.m. back then, but Walter Scott knew hmm. the journalists worked late hours, see? Yeah. So he set up a wagon outside the Boston Daily Club. Extra, extra, get a sandwich. <laughs> Soon, uh, lots of late night workers lined up for his night lunch. Everyone from businessmen to showgirls. Most of the wagons, of course, have closed, but one original still remains. The Owl Night Lunch Wagon in downtown Detroit. Uh, Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, that's fun. No lunch wagon. <laughs> 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 Uh, number one, you probably thought that the uh, uh, that the uh, country dancing of Diane Horner couldn't be any better. I think we showed her yesterday. Yes. yes. It was marvelous. Uh, but that's because you probably didn't know that Diane did a project with Bubba James Hudson. Check it Ooh. out. The most fun country dancing needs great country music. And now, Diane Horner, America's favorite country dance leader, presents Do You Want to Dance, starring Bubba James Hudson. All 13 songs in this special CD were arranged especially for country dancing, line dancing, and partner dancing. Bubba James Hudson is one of the rising stars in country music. Bubba and Diane worked for almost a year to create this hot dance music. It features some great country classics like Do You Want to Dance? Slow dancing, even a hip hop rendition of Lady in Red. Lady in Red. Oh boy. Oh no. Who is dancing? Well, where's the dancing? Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> a funky checkout girl. <laughs> oh, I'm a sub with a checkout girl. Oh. A Cajun styled Heart of Saturday Night. They do a line dance and they put on a country show. And the new country rap hit, Running Man Cowhand. <laughs> 
<laughs> Plus, as a special bonus, you'll get everybody's line dancing. This is a great new song from Bubba. Diane's created a brand new country line dance just for the song called The Bubba James. There's even a hot new techno version on this CD. Wow. Because at that point, anything he touched turned he was gold. Hot. <laughs> Everybody remembers it. the run he was on. Jeez. It's too bad we only had that one videotape with the wrinkle in it. That's the only yeah, one that still really exists. Yeah. You know? It's Darn like the old it. Bozo tapes. Another <laughs> classic. Yeah. Just Gone that nobody has copies yeah, of. In case you're wondering, they taped over all of those. So yeah. they don't exist. Everything you've seen in the specials is all there is. Yeah. I was on it somewhere, somewhere, yeah. taped over. I wonder why they taped over it. Yeah, it's a nine and nine. Sweet night.